Hey guys, how's it going? This is InstaFizz, and today I am recording more Terraria Aurora Realms with Aurora 3500. So, in today's episode, we're gonna start out by fighting another Eye of Cthulhu because, well, we need a more ore so we can craft another Blood Butcher. Also, um, we're gonna get ready on a elevator, okay? And we're Aurora's gonna need her uh, Deathbringer pickaxe so we can. So we. Yes, yeah, so she can get a better pickaxe, we can mine faster. Okay, so. Tell you what, you're gonna get wrecked and you can give us our looty booty. Okay. So we're gonna go over here and craft. A bunch of crimtain bars. And we are going to craft this blood butcher. Does do you have enough? I just wanna ask you, is that enough? Okay, yeah, and here's the blood butcher too. So we so another step closer to both getting us both knights edges. Knights edge, knights edge just Bleh, whatever. Okay. Does she have enough ore, though? Still need more to craft a pickaxe? Okay. Okay. Let's do this again. Okay, we just fought that eye. So, yeah. And she's gonna craft a Deathbringer pickaxe. And I made blood butcher her. Or Knight's Edge for you. Because getting two of the Knight's Edge is something I haven't really accomplished before. Like, it's something I didn't imagine possible. Perfect, I got the sword. Thank you, no problem. Oh, oh, she lagged out. Okay, we'll be back. Okay, guys, she's back. She's back. Just a little lag or something, we're not sure what happened. So while we're digging this elevator, we're gonna be on the lookout for- oh. Okay. Okay, this might be a problem. Oh well. Anyway, so while we're digging, we're gonna be on the lookout for, uh... Some gold ore, okay? We still need, like, seven pieces left so we can craft it, um, uh, a crown. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Oh. Okay, then. Um. I don't know what we're gonna do there. I, I think we can avoid it. Oh, uh, yeah, I like making elevators three bucks long. It's a cork I have. Wait. Three lux wide, you mean? I think that's what she meant to say. Right? Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant. Uh. Oh my god, no. Oh, wow. Okay, we'll be right back. I can continue elevator wife army? Yeah. Okay, so she's gonna work on the elevator while I fight the army. We'll be right back. A goblin army has been defeated. Okay, yeah, that's good. Now I just need to clear off these last few. Okay. There. Flying fish, you're not part of the army, are you? I'm sorry, Flying Fish, but you can't be a goblin. It's not physically possible. Sorry to break your dreams, buddy. Oh. Anyways. So, I don't know why the music's still playing. I don't see any uh, mobs around. Okay, guys. Sorry about that. There was a little bug. <clears throat> the goblin army music was still going on. It was really annoying, so we had to relog. Okay. So, there she is. Um, okay, tungsten ore. <clears throat> now, I think 
Yeah, this is good. Like, we can- I can work on one side while we work- she works on the other side. We can get this done in no time flat. Um, I don't know if I should speed this up or skip ahead. I don't know. But, whatever, I'll meet you back. Okay, guys, we were just digging a bit more of the elevator. <clears throat> Not much, though. Sorry, I keep clearing my throat, by the way. I don't know what's up. So, 31 of that, and we can craft a... Hello? Oh, yeah, we need a ruby. Okay. Um, one... Wow, one convenient ruby. Wow, okay. Um... I think it, I'm gonna take one of that, and then I'm gonna put away Golden Bunny! Oh! They can be sold for like 10 golds, right? Yeah. That's it. That's pretty much it. Oh, Gold or 17. Okay, yeah. Unfortunately, this is all the gold I'm gonna need. Um, so we can go over here. Craft the Urimer crown. Wait! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! I'm so used to, like, playing console. Like, whereas in console, you need 30 gold. 30 gold to craft a crown. But apparently, you only need 5 as of 1.3. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh my god. Oh well. Oh yeah, As also, in one- as of one po before 1.3, you only needed 99 gel, but now you only need like 20. So that's pretty good. Wait, given the fact that you only need 5 gold instead of 30, maybe King Slime would be an easy target for speedruns. Hmm. Uh, okay, well, spare gel. Anyone? Because I only need, like, eight. No, I only need, like, 12 more, I believe. Oh my god, 52. Okay, hold on a sec. Let me ask Mr. Guide. You need, you, yeah, you only do need 20. Okay, so... Okay, I only need 12 more, oh, or that, <laughs> okay, so, I'm gonna go and head to a demon altar, a crimson altar, <laughs> okay, if you look at it sideways, it's closed eyes, sticking out tongue, okay, whatever, anyways, so, crimson, I'm going to head over there. Because it doesn't seem like we've got a crimson altar on our way down the elevator. So yeah. We'll meet you back. Okay guys. We crafted the thing. Now let's see. Now I'm aware that it's going to be a pretty easy boss. Actually it probably wasn't the best idea to fight near the house. Well whatever. Anyways... I'm aware that this isn't an easy boss, but the fact thing is, we're, we're trying to go for all bosses, no matter the difficulty. We're gonna go for all the bosses, okay? All the bosses. All the bosses in the world. In the world. Okay, whatever. Anyways. Yeah, like I said before, I wanna see what kind of advantage the Bee's Knees has, actually. I heard it's a really powerful bow. But... Like I already said before. Oh! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! This thing homes! Okay. It kind of goes like a weird angle, like expert mode Skeletron than the thing they fire. Okay, that's pretty odd. Oh, God. What the? Did she get the loot? There wasn't a message that say King Slime has been defeated. Okay, wait. Do you have loot at all? No? She doesn't? I 
What? Me neither. Oh, well, a slime mount would have been nice. Um... Okay, that was very strange. We don't seem to have another ruby either. That's really disappointing. A slime mount would have been nice. Whatever. And no message saying King Slime has been defeated. Uh... Oh well. That sucks. Looks like he glitched out when it got defeated somehow, yeah. Indeed. Oh well, let's continue working on the elevator. We're finally here! <clears throat> the underworld. Oh boy, oh what? I just- <clears throat> I just got a time interface. There must be an obsidian clock nearby. Grandfather clock. <clears throat> I'm really sorry, I have to keep clearing my voice, I don't know what's up. Oh boy! Oh, there's a shadow chest already. And it... Seems like we have reached hell. Yay! Oh wait, what? Where's my shadow key? Oh, I don't have a... I don't have the... Oh, oh, um, that just happened. Rip jellyfish. Oh well. Anyway, so we're gonna put away some stuff. We're also going to get this shadow key. And we're going to fall back down because I was not expecting to see a shadow chest first thing. It seems like we have reached hell. Again, because I had to go back and get the shadow key. So there's our good old hell forge. And there's our first shadow chest. Really glad this is an expert mode. Voodoo demon, voodoo demon, voodoo demon. Ah, uh, bejeebus. Ah, uh, snap. And... Deadly flower of fire. Okay. So, alt, deadly flower of fire, but no, but no hellowing bow. Oh well, well I'm just going to take this shadow chest so I can use it in the future for a chest of guide voodoo dolls, which is a tradition I always carry. But whatever. I'll make a Molten Fury if we can't find Hellwing. Whoa! Coin portal! That's amazing. Okay. Well. So I'm gonna just go ahead and mine my way in here. And some stuff we're looking for is in Shadow Chests. I think the only thing that will concern me is... The Hellwing Bow, and I think that's really all I want to look for in these chests. Oh god, what? That was a lag. Oh, Titan Potion? Okay. Um, let's see. If, we get, if we're gonna look around for a bit, and I. Oh, wait. We can actually quite possibly. Craft some obsidian skin potions. And then we can... Okay, I hear mining. Faint mining. But... Okay, and then we can... I only have one... Um, I only have one, um... One... Oh my gosh, one fire blossom, okay? So we're going to need to collect a lot more. Oh, there's one obsidian skin potion right off the bat. Pretty much both of us only need like two obsidian skin potions, maybe three each just to be on the safe side. 
Lost hopes of man banner. That's depressing. Anyways, so yeah. We're gonna meet you guys back when I find more shadow chests. And when we uh, get maybe some uh, good obsidian skin potions. Yeah. Okay, guys, we're, we just found another shadow chest, and we found this useless piece of trash. <sighs> oh, well. Well, we I found three obsidian. No, I found three fire blossoms. So with that, wait, wait, what? Where'd the obsidian skin potion go? There was another chest here, lol. Oh. Went home to craft... I'll be skin potions. Obsidian, I mean. Man, I play too much Minecraft. Oh well. Um. I'm just gonna put some of this stuff away. Um, Hellforge, I think you can go right here. And I think. Okay, one guide voodoo doll, and where'd the obsidian skin potion go? It was... Where'd it go? We had three! Ah, oh, We had three already. Oh well. Um, do we have any water leaf? Water leaf, water leaf. Okay, please. No, I'm rush. I'm rushing through these chests. No water leaf. No water leaf. Um, no water leaf. No water leaf. No water leaf. Water leaf about. Any water leaf about? Um. Where is a desert? I don't think this... That's not much of a desert. Okay, so I'm just gonna... We got water leaf before? No, I don't think so. I just looked through all the chests. Anyways, I think I'm gonna head over to the... Head over to the... Desert. And see what we can do. Okay, I just went over. I found some water leaf. Not as much as the fire blossom, but whatever. So we're gonna go ahead and see if we can go like any bottled water. None. Nada. No, no bottles. I, are there bottles in here? Yep, there's some bottles in here. Bottled water. Also, I had some obsidian on me. Where did that go? Man, I really gotta get organized. Where's my obsidian? Where's the obsidian? Where? Where? Obsidian? Please. Okay, I'll end. this may take a while. Okay, so I just... I'm gonna ask Aurora for some obsidian and a sun fury. Sun fury. Here, she can have the blue moon. And I'm gonna need, yeah, I, I already said in chat I'm gonna need some 22 obsidian. So, yeah. Okay, if she, okay, I think she'll give it to me once there's not threats around. Is she, can, is she gonna give me the obsidian? Obsidian, please. Okay, guys, I just traveled home. I crafted some more obsidian skin potions after obtaining some water leaf, and Aurora is fighting a uh, slime rain. 
So hopefully we can get another attempt at King Slime because to make up. So yeah, I'm going to get started. I don't know if I'm going to speed it up or anything. I've been recording for a while now. So yeah, um, let's go ahead and mine. Okay, guys, finally, that took so long. There's no way I'm doing a time lapse of that. That was ridiculously long. It worked out well. Yeah, it did. Um, obsidian skull. Um, a cobalt shield. Tinker's workshop. And how I got the obsidian, you got the hellstone? Yeah, that did work out very well. So, after this, I'm going to smelt a bunch of... Oh, yeah, I'm going to need the hellforge for that. Hellstone bar. Let's get crazy. I've never mined so much in my life. That was insane. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, it keeps on coming. It keeps on piling up. This is amazing. Okay. So now... If I take this out, oh yeah, and I'm gonna need to take out this and this. Let's craft some stuff. Two molten greaves. Two molten breastplates. Two molten helmets. And let's see, one phoenix blaster. Um, one Molten Pickaxe, I will kill whoever killed that bunny. One Fiery Greatsword. Is there anything we're missing? Huh. Oh yeah, on second Fiery Greatsword. Here you go. Expanded my Mushroom Farm. And yeah, okay, I gave her all that. I believe there's something I'm missing, though. Have an enchanted boomerang anywhere? We've got an enchanted boomerang right here, so I can make a flamerang. Flamerang, flamerang. And yeah, there we go. That's pretty good. Now I can wear my signature kimono. Uh, oh, the thing she bought from the traveling merchant? Oh. Okay, I think her OC has it. He's selling a DPS meter as well. That's amazing. Okay. So. Let's craft the knight's edge together. Okay, so. Man, I'm super happy. So, I can replace some of the weapons now. So. Hmm. Hmm. Phoenix Blaster. Oh, wait, so I'm gonna have to put on all of this. I'm sorry, Space Gun, but you're gonna have to go away for good. Um. Okay, so. Molten Pickaxe. Well. It's a really slow pickaxe, I'll give you that. Yeah, that's a really slow pickaxe. And, oh. Oh. Okay, what's what's she wearing? That vanity set of hers. Is, is that what one of her original characters looks like? Okay. Knight's Edge! Yeah, that's what I like to see. Amazing way to end. So I'm gonna end the episode now. That was that was purely amazing. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Aurora Realms. If you did, leave a like if you want to see more. Subscribe for more content like this. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.